Hey guys, this is Camfrey15 back at it with another video for you guys. And I'm back with another, uh, well, new anime series review for you guys um, for to really kick off a fall of anime 2022. Now, obviously, this is the last video of the year for 2021. Um, so that's a thing. Um, so yes, we made it this far. And uh, yeah, but um, other than that, that's kind of it. So uh, yes, yeah, so there's a new fall of our winter of anime 2022 show that came out today. And that is called uh, so Sorario Utility. Um, and essentially the premise is it's a sports anime and is based off of sports that I particularly don't really watch all too much. If any, I don't watch. And it's essentially a sports anime about golf um and stuff like that but um yeah so let's talk about this anime or this this episode for um this week and yeah let's get into it so um anyways um so Wario utility um essentially like i said earlier is a sports-based anime and it's a golf anime or it's a sports anime about golf and you have these three girl characters um that are in high school one's named um ayaka minami and um haruka um now uh ayaka is the kind of the the girl wearing the pink outfit and she kind of has blondish hair um minami um or minami has like blue hair she reminds me of the one girl from aquatope of white sand just from the hair design and everything um and um, my favorite is Haruka because I think she looks the hottest out of the bunch, out of the trio. Um, but I like all of them. Um, she has brown hair and she wears like a yellow outfit and everything. But they're all friends in high school. And the thing is, um, Ayaka and Haruka are essentially like really good at golf and they do golf. And we kind of get a little bit into a little cut back in the flashback of um, Minami and essentially we find out that she kind of took an interest in golf and everything and she's trying out golf for really the first time and everything while well, her two friends are essentially like kind of pros in a way um are they really good at it she's not the best like she can't like she puts too much into her swing to where she just hooks it left and right and it goes into like this ravine area Listen, I don't know much about golf, to be honest. So, yeah. Um, but if you're out there and you like this show and you're like golf enthusiastics, well, I would definitely like to hear comments from you guys and stuff like that to get some understanding about the sport of golf, even though I particularly watch sports. So just golf is not one of my go to's. But essentially what Minami wants to do in this episode here is she wants to get a par um, and well, she doesn't manage to get a par because either she's shanking things left and right and stuff like that. And, you know, she's having trouble for swing. Like her friends say, like, she's kind of too stiff in her swing and everything. So, you know, that's why things are hooking left and right. But, you know, she gets like to the last hole area, the last, you know, field area that's would do. Um, and um, her friends kind of help her out to kind of just calm herself down because earlier in the episode, they took a very, they took a picture where her face looks very funny. Like she looks like she's a robot and everything um, and stuff like that. Um, and they just showed her the picture. She like got some of her nerves off and everything. And they just said, Hey, just take a deep breath and just like, well, really swing. Don't think about it. Just clear your mind and everything. Just think about something funny. And she managed to swing through it through it very effectively she managed to get on the green um and she only needed to hit it into the hole um one time um, to get her par but we find out later in a very in a uh as you can say a fan servicey bath scene that she managed not to do it um but um the one thing is she says like i'm gonna keep trying till i can get to it and you know we're gonna stick together through this and we're gonna do it and everything um i do i did enjoy this episode i do like the two i do like ayaka and haruka um as friends to minami like they don't put her down or anything like they genuinely have fun 
um, and mess around for like the picture thing they did. That was hilarious. I honestly freaking cracked up. I did like the whole thing at the start of the episode when they she gets this one, she bought this like one ball where she's like, this is me, the ball or the golf ball um, that's going to get me this par. And it's funny because I think it was um, Haruka's like, huh, I don't think a ball is going to change anything, but okay. Um, I mean, a golf ball. I don't want to sound all sexual or something in here, but this golf ball. And I like how they put this their initials on it. It's ham um, because obviously um, Haruka, uh, A for Ayaka, and then M for Minami. Um, and the whole thing is like, you see, we'll get through with the power of friendship. And that first swing she had, Minami and had, she's like, oh, crap. That's supposed to be my power of friendship and because it goes into the ravine the one where i cracked up the most is where she earlier she shanked it like left and it was in like the ravine area again um and she freaking swings it so hard it hits the tree and then goes back even farther than when she originally hit it at everywhere and it was it, it was funny because um if you know at the time when the very first Wii came out you know they had Wii sports and everything you know and you played the golf game and everything i remember always you know, doing the whole thing where I was swinging with my Wii remote and I hit the ball, it actually hit the tree and it went back. I was like, are you serious, man? Um, so yeah, um, I do like the characters of Ayaka and Haruka. I think they're nice, cool, calm, collected characters that clearly know um, the sport of golf and they just want to help their friend out and they're willing to help her out and get her, get, get her to be a better golfer and everything. I mean, stuff like that. And I do like their characters. I also do like Minami. I think she's a character. She's your typical character, especially in a sports anime, that wants to be the best at the sport she can be at. And she has her goals set to achieve or strive for. So then we see by the end, of the I'm guessing the anime, um, she'll probably be one of the best golfers in whatever whatever thing, which I'm guessing maybe they'll change, have a tournament at the near the end of this series where you know, she builds herself up to be so good. She enters in this tournament and she maybe ends up winning this tournament or it's like some sort of team tag team tournament with her two friends and other people and stuff like that. Um, I wonder if they're going to like do something like maybe she goes on the golf team or something like that. And yeah, so um, yeah, but I definitely did like it. I like the voice acting. The animation looks pretty solid. I honestly like the animation. It looks nice, clean and crisp. Um, And yeah, but you know, other than that, that's all I got to say. There's nothing really much else to say because there's really no tr story in this episode. There's kind of just an introduction to the characters and the main characters and what the main objective for our main character and Minami wants to do. And I'm guessing that's just be the best golfer possible she can be and stuff like that. I'm very intrigued with it. I saw it in Verve and I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll give it a shot. Um, and I watched it and I enjoyed it. Now, it was only 14 minutes long. I don't know if every episode... It's going to be 14 minutes long because this ep this series is going to be 12 episodes long. I don't know if each episode is going to be 14 minutes um, or if they're going to go. This was just for its one thing. It's all this one episode is 14 minutes and the rest of the episodes are like your typical anime episode 24 minutes. Um, but if it's 14 episodes, I'm fine with it. It's I think it's a solid enough length. Um, and yeah, and I think this is gonna be a pretty underrated anime um that people will probably sleep on mostly because it's a sports anime and then two it's a golf anime but it's very lighthearted, very heartwarming very nice it reminds me of that one um sports anime about the sport the sports climbing girl anime a bit um where it was about the few girl about the one girl i forgot her name i actually did a review on the channel about it i'll probably maybe maybe i'll link that into the end of the episode since it's a uh, um in my outro since it's a sports anime but it was about you know this one girl who wasn't really proficient in climbing um sports but throughout the route she had the special ability that could help her climb better and find these old puzzle maze routes while doing this and throughout the series or the throughout the season she got better at climbing obviously the walls and everything and stuff like that so i think it's going to take some some elements of that and, and um, incorporate into that from that aspect we don't have our main girl minami is not a good golfer um but we'll see that she has the potential to be a pretty good one um later down in this uh anime series um so yeah i also did hear this is an anime original so um yeah but as for a first episode of an anime original it got a very interesting start um very energetic 
cast of characters and i did enjoy it so yeah but that's kind of it of what i gotta say about sorario utility i don't know if i'm saying that right um but yeah but other than that guys if you guys like the video leave a like put in the comment section your thoughts on this anime as well as hit that subscribe button if you want to get more um reviews of this anime as well as some other animes of 2022 if you want to put in the comment section some recommendations of animes that i should watch and potentially review on the channel please as well put that in um there is going to be a few um um animes that i will review on the channel and stuff like that so yeah but uh other than that that's kind of it um so yeah so again like i said um, this is the last uh, video of 2021. Um, again, if you're a first time viewer, hey, hit that subscribe button. But if you've been on the channel, um, thank you for the continued support um, of supporting the content on the channel. And hopefully we have a great year next year and stuff like that. So um, yeah, other than that, I'm gonna get out of here, guys. So again, have a happy and safe New Year's. Um, and yeah, but other than that, I'm gonna get out of here, guys. Hopefully, you guys have a great rest of your day or night or whenever you're checking out this video. Until then, guys, I'll see you guys on the next video. See you guys later. Peace.